Oh, we're here. Ten year anniversary of Graffiti Heart. Yay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I asked some very amazing young African American artists to give us their interpretations of Black History Month and what it means to them. However, I wanted them to paint them. Let's start with Stina. We're coming back. Okay. Yes. Um, for the folks just joining us, Stina, give us a little insight as to what's happening with your painting. So I am currently painting my son, Soul. Mm -hmm. um, he is the inspiration behind this piece. And as it relates to Black history, I think that our history, I want him to be well, very well versed on our history, and mm -hmm. that is the foundation, um, which you see here are the books, which are unfinished currently, but that is the foundation is our black history. And I think that when you have a proper foundation and you understand where you come from, everything that he does moving forward will have more intention, and he will be able to carve his own story in history. Mm, okay, very deep. Love it. Devon. Hello. New Papa. How are yes. you, man? I'm doing good. Yes. All right. Well, let's talk about, and I said New Papa because your beautiful daughter is just about three months old, mm -hmm. and it's no doubt that she's part of your painting. Yes. Um, and so for me, Black History Month is about not only appreciating our history, mm -hmm. what we've done um, throughout the ages, but also making sure that we pass that down to our younger audience gotcha. as well too. And appreciating the women that also help us bring these this new generation in. Means so, a lot to you now that you have a, a newborn, huh? Yes, it does. Excellent. <laughs> All right, okay, and this is your wife. Yes, this right? is my wife. Okay. And then in the middle, yeah. you'll see there is a very special flower. It's yeah. a periwinkle, mm. which is a special flower that they put on the graves of the enslaved. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Wow, very deep. Speaking of deep, Isaiah, what is happening? Hello, hello. Oh, okay. So I'm working on, um, you know, a different section of this piece. Mm -hmm. um, and basically this, this part uh, symbolizes how, you know, a lot of the times we, we emulate things that we see on TV. TV, right. And I think there's a consciousness shift and a lot of people are starting to break down you know, old societal norms. Yeah. That's why the TV looks kind of like dilapidated and, and like it's falling apart. Mm. Still has a lo little way to go to bring those details out. Yeah. But, um, and then, and then I have a character in the TV, he's holding, you know, a weapon. Mm -hmm. And I want, to, that's symbolizing that, um, that the, the violence that we see on TV yeah, needs to yeah. stop. And this guy is kind of running away from that. So we're, running we're, away we're, from the violence. we're running away from the wow. violence and well we're done. moving into a different chapter of our of okay. our history into the future i like so, it wow yeah. deep i love yeah. it okay <laughs> we're gonna go back to you guys in the studio some tremendously talented artists and the messages um wayne christie and Jesse. i mean just powerful aren't they Doubt about that yeah. kenny i'm i'm they are incredible those wow. artists are something else man they're doing a wonderful always job always amazes me oh is that gorgeous mm -hmm. look at that wow